There's this new AI thing everyone's talking about today. The human, the humane AI pin. Okay, here we go. The humane AI pin has taken the world by storm and people can't stop talking about it. Incredibly really? poor proposition. Do I recommend that you get one right now? Definitely not. It's so bad, in fact, that I think it's actually kind of distracting to like understand what the point of the device is. Hi there. What does that do? I'm Sam Tucker. And today we have exclusive access to the humane headquarters. Welcome to Inhumane. So the humane pin integrates seamlessly with AI to answer the questions no one else can. Can I eat this? Yes, it's a vegetable. You're at a market. Hey, what should I get here? Let's read the menu or ask the waiter. Play songs from the last time we were here. She wants to play songs with her titties? And how are you getting phone reception in the middle of nowhere? Um. Oh, oh, it actually like has a projector on it. So you're... So you're <laughs> <laughs> so you can walk around like this and you can watch YouTube videos or whatever the fuck. Cool. Phone reception in the middle of nowhere. Wow. Um, so the AI pin was built with the help of a former Apple engineer. And he says uh -huh. the pin has no apps. It just processes all of your requests through AI. Oh, how wow. does that work, Imran? These AIs are streamed on demand at the speed of thought. All right, let's test out that speed with a real world example. Call Aaron. Huh. Guess his thoughts aren't very fast, are they? Is it? Oh, there you go. The pin attaches there it is. to your clothes there you go. only through magnets. Which means that if someone really wanted to, they could snatch that $700 right off your chest. Hey. And if you sure. attach the pin while using a pacemaker, I don't know, you might die. Still, your heart is going to explode. With us? Then let's have a look at some of the gestures. You simply touch the pin when you want to ask it a question. You can swipe to turn the volume up and down, tap to play, and pinch to foreplay. Yeah, and then you can, you can rub in circles to really get it going. Okay, so... Do you guys think 10 years from now, all this AI hardware is going to be so fucking sick and that right now we're in this like weird cringe transitory phase where they kind of have to go through this transitional phase. They got to have all these shitty devices in order to someday 10 years from now, 15 years from now, maybe you have the cool devices or, or do you think that AI is going to always be these, these AI hardware devices? Do you think they're always going to be shit and weird and clunky and invasive and annoying to use? We gotta see. Of course, if you want more control, you can Always use hand cringe. gestures. Just hold out your hand and the pin will project a display oh, wow. onto your palm. Tilt your hand to hover over different things, pinch fingers to select. That's probably a really bright light. So if you if you like project a thing out and you don't hold your hand up, you could accidentally blind someone because you have a very powerful laser shooting off of your chest like fucking Iron Man. And if you point that thing at someone's eyeball at their retina, ah! I'm blind. That could happen. Close your hand to go home. And if you want to turn uh -huh. off the device, just give it this gesture. Turning off. I know when I'm not wanted. There we go. <clears throat> Never. Now, this projector, of course, does use up a lot of battery. Okay, now it's only overheated. And so, does everything else on the device. I've had a pin nuke through the entire booster battery in two hours, while not really doing much of anything. And so it no comes way. with a battery booster as well as a battery mm. booster and the charging case, which has a battery. And with all these Whoa. batteries, it might just get through a whole day, especially if it overheats and turns off, which it tends to do. Okay, I, if, I, if I saw someone in public wearing one of these things, I would immediately assume that they are <sighs> Gibby Gobby, Glubo, Glubo Flubo, um, Gumby Bumby, immediately might just get through a whole day especially if it overheats and turns off which it tends to do your ai pin needs to cool down for a few minutes <sighs> wow this really Hold was yeah, engineered by an right, apple bro. guy wasn't it throw it in the fridge boys <laughs> the all new humane ai pin it can do everything make wow. me sound more excited well except the impossible subscribe today he's so excited yeah, so this uh so this sucks. <laughs>